lucky pass. Yep, it was one of the turning points for us at the end towards, you know, after the halfway point last season, yep. again coming back to the club because he just instilled a steeliness in the yeah, midfield and brought belief to it. Yeah, absolutely. It's kind of almost, but maybe what Jim Goodwin was perhaps doing previously in areas. Look, he's yep. been involved three or four touches and a great chance and a great oh! shot and a fantastic goal. Brilliant goal there. It's Gavin Riley, I think, who's stuck that right in the top corner. A fantastic finish. As he was just mentioned again, pointing, directing everybody in the right direction. A couple of good one-twos he was involved with. I think it's uh, Gavin Riley onto his left foot. Yep, yep Gavin Riley. Bang. Great goal. Fantastic. And that's just what we were looking for, Chris. Yeah, and Riley scoring against his old club there as well and just bang. Right into the keeper, the top hand of the, the keeper's right hand side. Keeper didn't have a chance here. Yeah. And you know, yeah, that's the start we're looking for. When Lowry was looking for the run of Moore, but Moore wasn't quite on the same page and didn't quite manage to uh, manage to get there. Mm-hmm. Stelly's happy just to escort the ball out for the throw in there. Just, just looking, needs a wee bit of movement somewhere. Stelly's just. Taking his time as McGinn can break, and again he'll switch the play towards Adam Eckersley. Eckersley looks forward, he's looking for the run again of Hilson. Hilson just drifts inside. Not quite a, a big punt. That's Cannon Smith, a big punt. This, however, yeah! is a great goal, a fantastic goal, and again it is Gavin Riley. Well, we just, I thought the, the attack seemed to just break down there, but. Came back in and Gavin Riley making no mistake, he's picked up a bit of a limp. Yeah, absolutely, Hearts were looking to break. But again, it was one back, very good pressure by St Mirren. Yeah, look at Riley, just takes it, turns left foot again, bang. I don't know if the keeper got a touch to it or not there, but certainly couldn't keep it out. Uh, and Riley, you know, adding to his goal from the first half. And the one to him again, but the referee again was just. Yeah, a wee ref, bit too close. The ref got between McGinn and the ball. Curry's done well, he? and he's fed in. Kenna and Kenna has an opportunity here. And he's gone for goal, and it's a good challenge by Baird, and it had to be. Uh, just deflected it wide, and I tell you what, he had Curry as he, yeah. Curry has unselfishly unloaded the ball a couple of times. I thought that was a stick on for the goal there, but yeah. Baird once again just making a, a good challenge just at the last minute, giving Hearts the corner. Some one defence chance just to regroup here. Curry not impressed though, but uh, Kenner didn't elect to, to bring him into play. It's Morrison firing it into the six yard box, but Sutton will clear and Stelios will finish the job, but only as far as Jamie Brandon. Brandon thought about the shot, and the ball's going to come across goal, and it must be a goal for Curry. It is indeed a goal for Curry, and Hearts are back in the game. Well, a slight uncertainty in the heart of defence there, yep. a little we've bit like Lost. Kind of seen that coming in some ways, haven't we? And we've said that, you know, Hearts, they've had the chance. There we go, yep. Oh, um, indeed, I think it was, I think it was, actually, it might have been, was it McGinn who just, I beg your pardon, no, it was not, it was Jack Baird, Jack Baird. Well, so, you know, taking a keen interest in what the young, younger guys are doing. I, th- I think they'll be generally quite pleased with what they've seen. Yeah, I think so. They've put up a good performance. Again, you know, St Mirren have had a great start for the league campaign and so they they would have looked at this as a real challenge. Riley, Riley coming in, Collins' his left foot. He's done really well. He cuts it back across to John Sutton. Yeah! And John Sutton heads it home from only two or three yards, which should surely put the game to bed. Yeah, well, that's what you get with John Sutton, isn't it, as well? You know, a good old-fashioned target man. Balls in, balls crossing. Wilder did great to get the run in there. Left foot cross. John just rises above the defenders. The keeper's already going to his left, and John just puts it to the right hand side of him. He was, he was never going to miss that. Was he? He's done that his whole career. Uh, super reliable in that situation. And just a couple of minutes, three, three minutes after, uh, Hearts have got themselves a goal. Any signs of danger, and they've just sniffed it out. 